Hey guys, Wild Willie here. I want to talk about a great little lantern for under the $30 mark. This is the uh, E-Tech City Rechargeable Power Bank Lantern. I'm really impressed with this, this lantern. Um, fairly rugged, fairly well built. This is actually metal for under $30. Now this lantern has a couple cool things I like about it, so let's go over it before we turn it on and I'll show you. So up top here, your three AA batteries. This is the main power source of the lantern. This is what it'll use first. Um, if the time comes and the Bell's batteries drain, it has a power bank with two uh, 3.7 watt uh, or 3.7 volt, uh, sorry, 220 milliamp batteries inside. These are the rechargeable ones. Now, what this is designed for is this is to dump charge your cell phone, and that's a lot of power to dump charge your cell phone with. That'll do a tablet, cell phone a couple times, anyways. I like this fact that if these batteries run out, this automatically kicks in. Now this is a lot of battery for these little lights that run in here. This will run, I don't even know how long this will run, I haven't had a chance to test it out yet, but it's going to run for a decent amount of time, especially with two sets of batteries, never mind just this one set. These uh, regular alkaline, I figure you're going to get 30 hours on high anyways at least, uh, not including these or anything else. So very simple to use guys. It has the DC port right there. You can um, you can charge USB, mini USB, to charge the batteries in the bottom here. And you can dump charge your cell phone or your tablet or any other things you want to charge, your camera or whatever. You simply plug that in and you're good to go. To turn it on, guys, there is no on-off switch. This is uh, actually lights up when it needs to be charged, it turns red. Or when it is charging, it turns red. When it's fully charged, it turns blue. To activate this light and turn it on, you simply fold up these handles. You don't have to fold up the handles. It comes with a little double uh, carabiner or two. And you lift. I'm doing this in the light because if I had it in the dark, it would mess up with the, the optics and everything else. So it's got a high mode, which is 180 lumens, 360 degrees. It's light all the way around, equal light, 360 degrees, 180 lumens. It's got a medium mode. I'm not too sure what the brightness is, but it's enough where if I hang it up here in my kitchen, I can see behind the kitchen, the living room. It's got a stellar red mode, and I love this, and I know it's hard to tell in the, uh, in the light. It looks more orange. I'll have to post a photo there with this. This red mode is absolutely mint for if you're around the campfire, if you're camping, and, and you don't want to lose your night vision at night, or even I like this for reading at night or in my room at night. It doesn't disturb anyone. It throws off a lot of light, but doesn't wreck the night vision. I wish more lanterns had this, had this in blue, green, or red, uh, blue and red specifically. And also one more press here on this button and it has the, the red strobe for emergency use. Now if you want to control the amount of light, all you do is you close this off and the less, the more you have it closed, of course, the less light and to shut it right off, simply clamp it shut. This is a neat little lantern that will charge your tablet, charge your phone, charge other USB devices. And for under $30, it has a, a hell of a lot of light and a long life in the, in the battery life to run your light. I like it. It's stylish. It's compact. The thing weighs under two pounds and it's fairly durable. Also, magnets, real strong earth magnets on the bottom. Stick it to a, where anything that's magnetic, a, a car, a fridge, whatever. So guys, really check it out on Amazon. They're under $30. You can all go to the, also go to their website. It's eTech City. I don't know if you can see that or not. eTech City right there. For under $30, you can get a camping version of this that just has the alkaline batteries, doesn't have the dump charge and the rechargeables in the bottom which is fine. Great little light, very versatile. You can throw it in a pack. Great, I think, for camping and, and the bug out bag and everything in between around the house emergency preparedness. So check out the lantern. I'm happy with it. It charges a cell phone well. I already tried that. So anyways, I'm Wild Willie and I got to get trucking. Remember, it's not a question if this shit hits a fan. It's a question of when. So always be prepared.